Hey guys, Nate here. Wanting to give you guys the afterthought after using the, uh, you know, butt plug jelly purple from Doc Johnson thing. I've used it for the past about 24 hours, I would say, and I recommend it. Um, as long as you uh, make sh word of warning advice here, make sure you clean your anus out really well during the shower or use anal douche. Um, I will talk more about anal douches later, um, those are kind of a weird subject, but, uh, yeah, it's, um, I definitely recommend you, uh, clean your, pay special attention to your ass in the shower or the bath or whatever, uh, and then I also recommend you lube your ass up and lube up the toy. Um, the, the bubbles, or whatever you want to call them, the, the bead effect, um, nice touch, I liked it, it felt different um there was a little discomfort at first because first time i ever put something in there for a long ass time but that's normal um after putting it in and pushing it out and putting it in a few times it felt really good i mean it's a great thing to use uh if you're into having stuff in your ass if you're a bottom or whatever if you're into having toys or objects in your ass it's a great thing to have um the base on the bottom of it is big enough so it doesn't go up your ass completely and get in your body. So that would be very unfortunate and you need to have medical help attention immediately if that was to happen. Um, definitely great to use when you're jerking off or whatever and you're masturbating, the technical term. Highly recommend but that particular tail butt plug. Like I said, it's very comfortable, very interesting. One negative but not so negative thing about it is when you're trying to put it in, because it, it is, you know, jelly, kind of, like, you know, it uh, bends really easily, which is good and bad, because when you're trying to put it into your rectum, it likes to slip, glide past it, and, you know, just go up your um, crevice, if you will. Which felt good too, so that's why I'm saying it's not a negative, but it's not so bad. It also felt interesting and good, so it wasn't like a bad experience. Just gotta try to get it into the rabbit hole, so to speak, and it can be a little challenging, but it's interesting. It's a toy. It's um fun. I enjoyed it. Um, the sensations I got from it was nice after a few times of putting in, taking it out, and putting in, taking it out. <laughs> I feel so weird saying that. Um, like I said, uh, it's when you plop one in there, you know it's like one bead in again. And it's one bead, uh, four beads or whatever. So it's like... <laughs> yeah, and then you get that final push in there. And then you get the, the plug is in there, the base. Like I said, make sure you use lube or else it will be painful and could cause damage to your rectum if you... Don't lube it at all. If you don't use lube on either the toy or your ass, you could cause you could cause damage to your anus. There's a website I read about butt butt plugs, which I will look for and I will link it down below. That gave good instructions on how to take care of it and how to use it. Um, first of all, you wanna wash all the finkel matter off if there is any on it, and or body ju body um <laughs> body. Um, we call it bio, or whatever. Um, not just fecal matter, but, you know, there's, um, body liquids and stuff again there. So you want to wash all that off, and then what you want to do is, under hot water, then you want to soap your hands up real good, and then you want to get it all soapy and cleaned, then you want to rinse it under hot water, let it air dry, and after it's been air dried, I'd recommend like its website said, I'd recommend putting it into a Ziploc bag. That sounds kind of weird. It's like, oh, my lunch goes in a Ziploc bag. No, put this in a Ziploc bag to keep it from getting dirty from air particles or whatever around that where you can put it somewhere and not worry about getting dirty. That's a safety thing. That's why you want to put it in a Ziploc bag. So, that's my advice to you. It's really fun to use if used safely, if used properly. It's really fun. So, um, 
I will link the website under here of where I saw the article on how to use and properly take care of butt plugs. Thank you, and this is neat. I hope this is very informative and very helpful to you, or at least interesting. If you like, if you thought so, please give this video a like, comment down below, and I will gladly answer any questions you have based on my experiences thus far, or I will look up and give you an answer, which will both educate me and you. Until next time.